three, two, one. What? What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Seth, and we are back in with some more trolls. And today we're going to be doing an unboxing video that is fairly long overdue. Uh, the Golden Ticket Chest from 2018. So this was from the Sunfest event that we had a couple months back. Uh, I've had them for the longest time. Never ended up actually opening them. We can end up getting the Hyper X Pinata Mount, which is one of the mounts that I still don't have in the game, or some Golden Companion Eggs, and I would be much more, uh, you know, much more intrigued by getting something like that because we got to stock up for whenever they decide to put U10 out, right? But I thought that it was about time we ended up having an unboxing video. There are a bunch of other different boxes that I can end up opening and stuff like that. But honestly speaking, uh, content for Trove is getting pretty thin. So pretty soon we're actually going to get back to the Let's Play series and just kind of messing around with that stuff. And I'm, I'm kind of excited about it. But in either case, let's get to it. Before we get started, would appreciate if you would hit that like button, sub if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, so we're going to trigger the Karma at least two times. Karma uh, is not affected by Patron, it seems. So hopefully we can end up actually getting something worthwhile. I didn't know that it could actually give us the uh, water gem dust boxes. So that's not too bad. That's disgusting. I completely forgot that it gave us fragments for that dragon. Because for some reason, like, I don't know why they give you so many fragments for that dumb dragon. It's like, why? I don't, I don't need it. That dragon is literally, like, so easy to get. Oh my gosh, it's been months since these boxes were into the game. And I remember seeing everybody else's luck with them and just thinking... Wow, that's bad, just because of the fact that they end up giving you the actual fragments, which isn't, like, it's not inherently bad, but it's like, that dragon is, like, literally the easiest thing that you could get. Like, it's like, if you eat pie, it's as natural as eating pie to get this dragon. So, I'm going to just end up loot collecting. Ba -ba! There we go! Golden egg, baby! That is way better than what we could have gotten, honestly speaking, because I don't, I don't need the Hyper X, like... It'd be kind of cool to have it, just because, again, it's an item that I don't have. But, uh, I don't really care at the same time. <laughs> I'd rather have the golden eggs, because the odds of actually getting, like, when U10 comes out, we're supposed to be getting a new rare companion, and those things, like, dude, they're literally, like, ridiculous RNG to end up getting them. Uh, or ridiculous amounts of pay to win and I, I you know I'm not against pay to win in this game you guys know this but being pay to win for something as unlikely as you know like you literally have to spend like $50 to get a golden companion egg with the chance of it giving you duplicate rare companions or the one that you need to unlock and there's no good system like in Maple Story. you can't loot collect the companions uh, like the rare companions to get a fragment to getting the companion that you actually need which i mean if they added something like that to the entirety of the game i think that would be fantastic wouldn't it like you should be able to uh loot collect either dragon egg fragments or just if you craft a full dragon egg you should be able to loot collect it to get i don't know fragments or dragon coins or something something that you could utilize for the other dragons you know Ooh, silver companion egg i'll take it I never touched any of the geode stuff anymore, honestly speaking. But hey, you know what? I'll take it. I don't really care. Whatever. So we're about to trigger karma in five, four, three, two, one. What? <laughs> oh gosh. Oh man. You know what? At least we can see that the devs have been messing up with Trove like since 2018 because I didn't know that that counted as a rare. Like that's actually like who who thought that was a good idea? I mean granted you could have grinded out these boxes because they were you know dropping from Pinata Invaders. So there was the possibility of just grinding up a lot of them. I know Merc ended up uh, having a whole ton of them. I forget whether he did an unboxing video or not on them. But uh, for me, I didn't have the time. You know, at the at the time I was not only just busy in general with life stuff, but I'm also just busy as a content creator, you know? I don't have as much time to grind all those useless things. Back, that's the thing too, is back then I wasn't streaming as often as I am now. So yes, give me all of the gem dust. Give me a full stack. Come on, man, give me a full stack. Give me a full stack of gem dust, I said. Give me a full stack, not just a thousand. I want a full stack of gem dust. There it is, baby. I knew it was there. I knew I could count on you. <laughs> Super recipe stash. Okay, I'll save those. 
the style surprises i don't think i'm even saving these because if i'm not mistaken yeah i've got uh, like over 700 super style savers so i don't really need these ones i i guess i'll save them because why wouldn't i wow out of all those boxes 1200 flux Fragments should really be tradable, dude. Like, they honestly should. That would be way better. Have I been saving these? Not enough slots. No, I haven't. I think you need, like, normal style savers, if I'm not mistaken, just for, like, certain items as well. So I am going to save those, actually. But that's going to do it for today, everybody. So a short but sweet unboxing video. Otherwise, I got to go and get my daily and stuff. And maybe I'll end up doing some more unboxing videos pretty soon. I, it's getting to that time again where I probably should end up unboxing some Troves of Wonder. But, I mean... Honestly speaking, like I'm, you know, I'm sitting here at three mil. That would be 300 more Troves of Wonder, which I'm considering that for sure. Because honestly, there's not really anything else for me to spend my flux on at this point. But getting another Gonda is just kind of like, who cares? You know, I guess I could finally end up giving away a Gonda because that's always been my dream. And Gonda is actually really expensive right now. Yikes. Uh, this one's actually more considerate price rather than just, I mean, normally they're like 11 to 13 mil. But uh, yeah. Anyways, that's going to do it for today. Thanks for watching. Very much appreciate it. Don't forget to like, sub, hit that notification bell if you haven't already. Uh, otherwise, if you want to support me, you can always sponsor the YouTube channel with the join button. Check my real life merch. Or check out the link to Gawkbox, which is a way you can donate to me for free. Sign or and stay epic, everybody.